nice relaxing day of me just sitting around without a care in mind. Just being me. <sighs> Why do I get the feeling something's behind me? <laughs> ah! <laughs> Dinosaurs! Who are you guys? We are the time traveling dinos. Time traveling what now? Yeah, my name's Jaw Dropping Joe. <laughs> Jaw Dropping Joe, because my teeth are so jaw dropping. Get it? Dude, <laughs> don't let the teeth intimidate you. <laughs> and I'm Catapult Rex. Catapult Rex. Yes, because I can catapult with the back of my feet if anybody tries to attack me. And guess, let me tell you something. <laughs> what? This one time, I catapulted a caveman to the other side of the world, and, and now, he's somewhere on a stranded island, probably scared crapless. Okay. And I am Douglas. Douglas, the, Douglas the Bulldozer. <laughs> Douglas the Bulldozer. Yes, because if anybody tries to tick me off, I'm gonna bulldoze them to the ocean. <laughs> and I'm Harry, the Nobody. Okay, I was expecting something more dope. Exactly. Uh, I don't have so. I don't have. I don't have something yet. <laughs> Okay, time-traveling dino, so who is your leader? That would be me. I am Bob the T-Rex. Bob the T-Rex, uh, uh... Please don't hurt me! <laughs> I ain't gonna hurt you, don't worry. <laughs> Time-traveling dinos. We come from the prehistoric age. You, wait, you guys have time travel back then? Well, yes. It appears we have discovered it way before you guys even have, so we were way ahead of our time. But anyway, we time-traveled here just to check things out, and then some monkey came and snatched our time cube, which is what we use in order to time travel. And so, we need your help to get it back. Why do you guys need my help? Because we're not stupid. Hey then, uh, let's go, I guess. Uh, I'm a dinosaur. <sighs> okay, so, um... What, what do you want us to do? We need to go and find the time cube. <laughs> Without it, we can't... How are we gonna get back home? Where are you guys from anyway? Uh, duh. <laughs> We're from a million years ago. I know, but like what year? I don't know, but we gotta get back to our time. So you dinosaurs discovered time travel way before we even... We even... We even found time travel? Yes. We were way ahead of your people's time. Well, well, there's cat. Yeah. Yes. Without the time cube... We won't be able to get home. I, I don't know, why not stay here? I mean, I mean, Earth is, I mean, look at, the, look, Earth is beautiful by this time. <laughs> uh-huh. And also, I mean, like, come on, back in your guys' time, remember the, the extinction? The, the asteroids, the volcanoes, and all that stuff? <laughs> like, come on, why do you guys want to go back there? Because it's our destiny. Well, <laughs> we'll go down in history. Oh, yeah. Uh, but, like, come on. I mean, the, remember the, ex the extinction? Alright, listen here, Travis. Okay. Travis, listen. What? Cavemen... <laughs> what about cavemen? Okay, you know there were cavemen back in prehistoric times, right? Yes? And... And, like, how did they act between... How did they act when it came to you guys? They ran for the hills. <laughs> but, you see... It, in your era, dinosaurs and people can't coexist. Oh. No. <laughs> uh, 
Wait a minute, we have some dinosaurs in this time. Like the Yoshis and Dino. <laughs> it was from... It was a green dinosaur toy we used to have. It was from the old era of Chaos Mantle. Uh, I remember we used them back in 2014. All right, we get it. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, well, that's because... <laughs> That's because of the events of Jurassic Park. And the Yoshis apparently were smarter than the dinosaurs. <laughs> uh, but, like... So you're telling me that there's a Jurassic Park around here? Yes. And that's where they keep... Re uh, that's where they keep recreated dinosaurs. Yes. <gasps> sure, it may sound exciting, but at the same time, it's scary. Oh, fine. But like, I don't, I don't get it. Why do you guys want to go back to your time when you know what's going to happen? Travis, we don't belong here. <laughs> Come on. No, we need to go back into our time back in the prehistoric age. Where we'll go down in history after the extinction. Our fossils may be found in this time. <laughs> Y'all are disturbing. <laughs> what's so disturbing about... What's so disturbing about that? So, you're saying that you want to die, or... No. Travis, look, look around you. Look at your time. We got cars here, got some beautiful landscape stuff here, got buildings around here, there's people everywhere, animals as far as the eye can see. Look, tree here, trees there. If dinosaurs <laughs> were to still exist in this time, you know how chaotic, you know how chaotic it would be. I assume as chaotic as downtown Portland. <laughs> Savage. And exactly. <sighs> Alright, fine. We'll find the time cube so you guys can, can go back to your time, but I wish you guys could stay. I do too, but don't worry, Travis. We may meet again. In another life. <sighs> fine. <laughs> Ew. Dang that monkey strong. <laughs> It appears the monkey has left a trail. Ah, good. We're getting close. So, um... Tell me. Uh... What... Uh, what was... So, okay, so, tell me. Uh, tell me. Tell me. So just tell me how... How did you guys, like, I am... I am so confused right now. Uh-huh. Okay, well, uh, just tell me. Uh, just tell me. Uh, Bob. <laughs> yes. How did you guys manage to time travel? Like, how did you discover time travel way before any of us did? Well, yes, we were ahead of our time. I don't know. It was just one time, we, we were just hunting for something, and then we found this, like, then we tripped over a stick. <laughs> and then, the stick, uh, broke off a piece of the ground, and there was a, there was a shiny orb thing. A shiny cube-shaped orb, <laughs> and so we took it out, and we were, uh, studying it. And then we tried it out, and uh, we discovered time travel, because as we used it, we time traveled to the year 1990 at a Boltster Band concert. <laughs> and then we used, then we, then that's when we discovered time travel. So we used the time cube to time travel to places to see what the future looks like and what will happen <laughs> after and what. Earth will look like after the prehistoric age. And then, and when we time traveled here, some monkeys snatched it and ran away with it. And so now we gotta find the monkey because we gotta get back home. Or else, we'll be hunted. Okay. <laughs> Damn. <sighs> the monkey should be in here. Travis, open the door. Okay, whatever you say. Hello? 
Any monkeys? Travis, what? <laughs> I have a family to raise. Eh, I don't have time for this crap. <laughs> Travis, come on, we need your help. I know. Give us the cube! Jeez. I'm gonna eat good today. Dude, hey, hey, dude, chill. I'm ticked off he took the cube. Uh, hey! Don't hurt this monkey! <gasps> Are you team monkey? <laughs> Are you on that monkey's team, you monster? You tricked us! No, but I know this monkey. This monkey's a pet. <gasps> this monkey's a pet of a friend of mine. So don't be- don't eat this monkey. <laughs> but he took the cue! He obviously- well, he didn't know and- You know, he's just a monkey. Huh? I thought this was supposed to be smart. Uh, fine. All right, now. Oh, I, oh, I dropped it. Oh, it's scared thanks to you. Oh, all right, now go home to your owner and stop being a brat. Stop being a brat. to go on. Okay, I got. Uh, well, here's your guys' cube. Well, at least we got the cube back. All right, boys. Let's go back to our time. I miss my lift. All right. Let's bite on the cube. Farewell, Travis. I still think your guys' destiny is pretty disturbing. Well, goodbye, Travis. Well, time to get home. Lair's cooking breakfast, and <laughs> Jessica. Just did something smart again that scared Lara because she's just a baby and it's like, eh. Meow. Meow. <sighs> Alright, back home, man. I can't wait for breakfast with my family. There's a cat and another cat. <laughs> Cute little cats. Meow. Meow. What? What's this? Ugh. A fossil? To Travis Ferk. <gasps> It's a fossil of Bob. I'm gonna keep this. No museum is gonna take this. <laughs> it is personally mine. <laughs> All right. Well, time to get back to my house. Are you coming in? <laughs> All right. Well, time for some breakfast. That was nice helping out those dinosaurs. I can't believe they found out about time travel way before we did. <sighs> well, time for breakfast.